What up guys, my name is Adrian from TheMotorcycle.com. In today's video, we're gonna be doing a hub oil change, final gear oil change, final drive oil change, whatever you wanna call it. Your shaft drive oil, it probably hasn't been replaced in a long time, we're gonna do that. There are a couple other videos on YouTube how to do it, but they're like seven minutes long, and I think we can do better and give more information in less time, so let's try it. Here's what you're gonna need. 17 mil bit, that's to take off your filler right here. You're gonna need a socket wrench to basically torque everything back to specifications. You're gonna want a six mil, that's for the drain plug, which is underneath here, and SAE 80, and the last thing you'll need is just a pan to catch everything in. First tip I recommend, this is your filler right here. Before you just drain everything out, take this off, make sure it's not seized up, because you don't wanna end up with no fluid inside and no way of getting this off. Now you're gonna to wanna to make sure the bike is in an upright position when you're doing this. And it should be filled right to the limit here. It does seem like this is maybe a tiny bit low from when it was done last time. Also, you're gonna to wanna to make note, there is inside of here a little rubber washer. You're gonna to wanna to replace that with a new one and then lubricate the new one before you put it back on. So now that we know that we can get the filler off, we're gonna to wanna to get the drain bolt off, which is underneath here. So we're gonna grab our six mil. Also note this little washer on here, Honda service manual does say to replace that washer as well. Now while you're waiting for this all to drain out slowly, is a great time to just go and take your dog for a walk. If you don't have a dog, go and adopt a dog. Dogs and motorcycles are pretty much the two best things a guy can have in life. Now that's done draining, grab your torque wrench, set it to 12 newton meters. I use a torque wrench because honestly, I'm showing people on YouTube how to do their thing. If you're just doing this yourself, if you're a mechanic, you probably don't use a torque wrench. You probably just go by feel. But I have to assume that most people are not just born knowing how to do stuff by feel. So since I'm trying to teach you guys, I just show you guys how to do it using a torque wrench. So I always just hand tighten it just to get started. Grab my torque wrench, little six mil adapter in there. And the torque wrench is going to snap when it hits the right torque. That click you heard, that clicked there perfectly. Next we take our SAE Hypoid Gear Oil, 80 weight. I'll post a link to everything that I'm using, tools and oil in the description box underneath this video. Then you literally just pour it in there until it starts to overflow out. I believe it's 140 millimeters if you want to pre-check um, it, but the service manual does say you can pour it in until it starts to pour out. And this stuff's pretty cheap, so I would rather make sure that I over pour and have a bunch coming out so I know for sure it's good than risk not having enough in there. Grab a clean shop rag to wipe up all the excess. Also guys, keep in mind, I have a bunch of videos coming up on how to service this bike, everything from brakes, oil, uh, filter, everything. So subscribe if you wanna see those, like this video if you find it helpful. So on here, fresh O-ring, dab your finger in some of the hypoid oil, put it around the lip to lubricate that O-ring. And again, I'll start with hand tightening this. To make life easy, this is actually the exact same torque spec as the drain bolt. So I just put my 17 mil and we're gonna do the same thing. That click there, I'll do it again. That tells us we're there. And that's it, you just did it a whole thing all by yourself. Save yourself a bunch of money versus doing it at the dealer. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe for more videos on how to service your Fury. Thanks for watching guys, peace.